Hi, this is Marto. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video, I will show you a game between Najdic and Debashis. This is a game from World Rapid Chess Championship played in Qatar in 2016. Najdic had white pieces and he started d4. Debashis played d5. Knight to f3, knight to f6, bishop to f4, c5, e3, e6, c3, White is playing the London system. Knight to c6, knight from b to d2, bishop to e7, bishop to d3, and now knight to h5, intending knight takes bishop. Bishop to e5, knight takes on e5, knight takes on e5. This is discovered attack on the knight on h5. Knight goes back to f6, f4, and both players cast at king's side. Queen to b6, attacking the pawn on b2. How to defend the pawn? Perhaps b3 comes to mind, or maybe rook to b1, do you agree? Nidic played queen to b1. Not only defending the pawn, but helping with the attack on black king. Queen to c7, rook to f3, intending rook to h3, g6, rook to h3, bishop to d7, knight from d to f3, bishop to e8, knight to g5. The pressure on black king is increasing with every move. Bishop to d6, queen to e1, intending queen to h4, h5, queen to h4, queen to e7, rook to f1. White is standing better. Do you agree? King to g7, rook to g3, lining the rook with black king. C takes on d4, c takes on d4, black to move. This is the critical position from black player's point of view. How should black continue? Debash is played rook to h8, knight to e4. Udofa, the best resistance. Bishop takes on e4, d takes on e4, and perhaps then black is threatening f6, and the knight must go to c4. And black is fighting back. Rook to h8 was played. And this move has a downside. This is the critical position of the game. Why to move? What would you do? Please pause and find the winning move for white in this position. Nidic had to calculate very carefully because if this move doesn't work, he loses the game. The move is he was betting on his horse, on the white horse. Knight on G takes on F7 removing the pawn that was defending the pawn on g6. Bishop takes knight. Bishop takes on g6. Black to move when black has a problem. Knight to g4 was played. If bishop takes on g6, rook takes on g6, check. King to f8, rook takes on f6, check. And white is winning. So we have knight to g4. This is also discovered attack on white queen. Queen takes queen, bishop takes queen, white to move, white play the move and black resigned. The move is bishop takes on f7, winning a piece and also white is threatening h3, winning the knight. If black plays bishop to h4, then rook to h3 attacking the bishop after knight takes on e5, f takes on e5, bishop must go to a safe spot, then bishop takes on e6 and after say Rook from a to f8, defending f7 square, bishop takes on d5. The dust has settled, and white is four pawns up. That is why play with black piece is resigned in this position. And let's go back to this most critical position of the game. This is the position. Did you find the killer move? If you did, congratulations. What do you think?
of this game. And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your tests and bye for now.